speed. Keith Lee versus Max Caster in the main event. So Max Caster, has, they're in Texas. He had some line about Ted Cruz running away from a snowstorm and a tribute to Razor Ramon in there. But my favorite line is when he just says, you must be new here. Those colors are ours. You're going to have to get some new gear. Yeah. I like that. That was a good rap. Yeah. So they had a very different AEW match. It was, in a good way, slow. Keith Lee did a lot of standing there and looking impressive, and Max Caster stood there and looked scurred. Keith Lee has the best spot ever, and that is his overhead throw. Yes. Because... As noted, it's not like one of those beautiful suplexes where you pop the hips and all that shit. Sure. He grabs you and he fucking throws you straight up in the air and over and onto your back. Yes. And he doesn't arch. He doesn't bend his legs. No. He just goes. <laughs> he throws them. And they fly up in the air and they crash on the ground. It's the fucking greatest. This guy's so strong. I don't know if you're aware of that or not. He is a beast. He, he does his... Big strong dude. His one agility high spot. The leapfrog drop down high cross. Didn't even do the high cross. That's right, because... Uh, Caster stopped. Caster threw up. That's true. That's true. So, but ba- basically, it's very methodical. He stands out. He works a different match now. It's better for him. And it's, it's better for him anyway. This is a better match than he usually has, but it also helps him to stand out from everyone else on the show because he's working at a much different pace. So, Powerhouse Hobbs comes out to watch. There is a brief heat segment for Caster, but Keith makes his comeback, and even his comeback is super deliberate. It is one move and shoot a mean stare. And it's block a punch and stare at him forever and then do the big double hand chop or whatever. And eventually Caster tries to lift Lee for something, but he fails because Lee is huge. And so Lee grabs him, hits the Big Bang Catastrophe, and wins. You know, at the end of the day, it's uh, don't do more than you need to. Yeah, less is more. I mean, this is how much this guy needs to do to get massively over. And so uh, what's the point of doing a lot more? Like, you can bust out some cool move every now and then or something new or mix it up a little bit. But, you know, if you're going to get over this big, moving at this pace, at that size, then uh, then that's what you should be doing. And uh, I also like on his, uh, which I don't think they called the Big Bang Catastrophe here, I've noticed. I don't think they've given it a name yet. No, I don't think they use that uh, that name. But anyway, the, the ring is uh, it's bouncy and everything, but it's not as bouncy as Keith Lee makes it. He has a way of hitting the move and then doing an extra gigantic bounce. So it looks like he's an asteroid that has hit the Earth. Although they don't bounce, I've heard. Hmm. But just the great weight. So I think it adds a lot to the uh, to the finish. It's not as cool as what uh, Impact does with Jonah. Which is, uh, they, they basically have the camera guy put the fucking camera on the mat. Hmm. Filming up. And so at Impact, the camera like bounces high in the air. It's awesome. But uh, this is this is the second best. So uh, allow me to complain for a moment. The basketball game went long. I had my DVR set. So I lost 20 minutes of the end of this show. So I went back to find it on demand. On demand, you cannot fast forward and you cannot rewind. Oh, wow. On demand what? What do you have? I have DirecTV. Ah, well, if Not I may bad. give a, a bit of advice here, it is to mm-hmm. switch to YouTube TV. Because they also have a little man. It might actually be Fauntleroy. I don't know what he does in his off time. but Does he have a boat? Uh, this, this bloke actually uh, goes right. in and he, uh, he splices it up. Okay. So you never miss anything if you watch the replay. It's pretty yeah. handy. So uh, to watch this match, I actually had to turn the TV on, start the direct TV on demand, and let the whole thing play because I had only the last ten minutes to watch. Well, Great it, was match. it was a good show. Yeah, it was. <laughs> I didn't need to watch it twice. There's yeah, worse shows you could watch twice. So Keith Lee wins, and afterwards he's many, many shows that are worse. Yeah. Oh yeah. He is jumped by Starks and Hobbs and the acclaimed, but then Swerve comes out to make the save, and I guess we're getting Swerve and Keith Lee versus uh, Starks and Hobbs, I guess. Cool. The end of Rampage. Yeah. Thumbs up. <laughs> yeah, that should be a good match. Yeah, that's it, everybody. That was Rampage. I like the show a lot. Very good show. Now I get after this show to go watch SmackDown. Oh. Where I think they tried to kill Roman Reigns or something. Oh, great. 
And they allegedly broke Bianca's hyoid bone. Oh, fun. Oh, jeez. I need some fucking... I'm your host, Brian Alvarez. Joined, of course, by Big Vinny V. Hi, Brian. Craig. Hello. Lance Storm. Is that a towel? Craig, uh, legit looks like Julius Caesar. Yeah, I did my, my hair down. Oh, really? Oh, wow. Yeah. Seems like we got a lion loose in, in uh, Lance's house, coincidentally. Yeah. <laughs> Is Lance, that a Lance, puma? Lance brought the yeah. jungle beast. I was hoping Bridger would come along to either feed me these grapes or wave me with one of those big fans, but when I suggested this, she was surprisingly negative. What? Why? I didn't like that idea one bit. Why? Oh my god, Vinny, please. Mm. Make sure you take that outfit to Hawaii and get video of you running down the beach in it. Oh, bro, oh. Th this thing's going everywhere with me. It's awesome. All right, here we go. I couldn't take a big one. Ugh. Mm. Excuse me. Look who's here. Vinny, hand her them grapes. I have the greatest wife. She's going to give me a couple of grapes, not too many. I'm on a low-carb diet. <laughs> like all Romans. <laughs> have you ever eaten a grape before? It's not alive. I've never fed a grape. Thank you, love. I appreciate it. I'll take one more. No, I won't. Oh, God, she's really... Hey! One more. Knock it off! Hey, we're not having a food fight in here. God damn it. <laughs> Grapes all over the floor. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.